Welcome back to another Played Letler, where I give you several first impressions and mini reviews in one single video. Today I have a package which says Elden Ring. I'm gonna unbox that later in the video. And I'm going to talk about Live a Live, which is maybe Live Alive, Live Alive. Also some other games that I've been playing, including Sniper Elite 4 and Stray, the new cat game. So let me start off with live a live. How do I say that? Live alive. I've heard someone say live alive. It's the new Square Enix game and I'm playing it currently. I got it from Bergsala, thank you. So this is a game that is a turn-based RPG set with an overview look, very retro inspired look on the entire game, but very pretty. <laughs> and it has several storylines that you can delve into. I started with a prehistoric storyline, which I guess is the first storyline if you are thinking about time. So in the prehistoric part of the game, you play as a cave boy whose job is to hunt for food for the tribe together with his gorilla friend. And they find a girl and hides her in their room and it is about him saving a girl from another boy. And I have also started the Wild West storyline. <laughs> So many storylines, but I find this game to be uh, special already. It feels sort of fresh. And that's funny because it is a remake of an older game, but there's just something special with this game. I am intrigued, is what I want to say. And I can so far say that I recommend the game. Live a live. Mm -hmm. I thought I would show that off and I'm just letting you know that I am currently playing it. My first impression is good. Because of what you got dangling between your legs. <laughs> now I want to also let you guys know that I have a website now that's called ishagaming.com and I have a discount code for all the Nintendo credits that you can purchase on this store. My code is isha10, that means everything on the Nintendo eShop is essentially 10% off on top of other sales and that is so much better than no percent. <laughs> It's good stuff. Thought I would mention that. Now another game that I have been playing, but I haven't been playing it alone. Now, I don't know if you know this, but I have gotten a new kitten. Ishaman and I, we got a new kitten. His name is Snurra. He's the most wonderful cat, the cutest cat, the kindest and calmest cat kitten ever. He's just mama's little boy. <laughs> I love him already, but I'm getting into Stray here. So I fired up Stray. As I like to say, I fired up Stray. <laughs> I fire up things. So Stray is the new cat game. It is out on PlayStation and I think it is out on PC also, but I'm playing it on PlayStation 5. It was included with PlayStation Premium, which was previous video, what that was all about. It is a very cute game. And for once, I feel like it is bringing something new to the table because I have never played a cat game that is this cat like. You can push things off tables, you can sharpen your claws, just being a cat basically. But my kitten is watching me play Stray and that is the cutest thing ever. I also got a lot in my inbox on Twitter and Instagram that people are playing this with their entire family, including toddlers and the dog in the house and the cat in the house. This is a game for the family. This is definitely a game for everyone to watch and enjoy because everyone loves Loves cats. What is up with that? Cats are taking over the world. I love cats. I want to hug every cat. It's just wonderful. I haven't completed it yet, but a bunch of people on my Discord channel has already. Uh, Tiny Hats did it in one day. And I can already say that I recommend the game because it is just really visually beautiful. You are a cat that is strayed, sort of, from your other cat friends and you're trying to find your way back to them. We also talked about Stray on the podcast and Tiny Hats gave her first impressions mini review on the game. So listen to the podcast also. But I want you guys to check this out. Stray, really cute. Snurre really likes it. <laughs> he just loves the game. Now, something else that I'm also playing lately, upstairs, having a fun time, but it's more like I need a game like this sometimes. If you have followed my channel for some time, I guess, you know that I enjoy sniping things from a distance sometimes. 
And yeah, I started Sniper Elite 4 and I think it is better than I expected it to be. I couldn't wait for it to get on sale on the Nintendo Switch, so I saw it on PlayStation, I downloaded it because it was in the, you know, the catalog, subscription-based catalog. And I'm kind of glad that I am playing it on PlayStation because this is a thing that I've been thinking a lot about now that I've started doing some PlayStation videos, is that the graphics are just better if you are playing on the TV with PlayStation and Xbox than Switch. Switch is starting for me now to show aging. When you're playing docked and you have your game on the TV, I don't think it is as good as the other companies right now. So oftentimes right now I found myself to prefer PlayStation and Xbox because the Switch is just falling behind now that I've gotten a PlayStation 5 and this Series X. Games on the Switch just look dated. I think it is really about time that we get a Switch Pro. I have all the consoles and I see this. I see the comparisons between games and oftentimes the same game is ported to all systems. Like for example Immortals Phoenix Rising. You can just clearly see that the Switch is falling behind. I don't want it to fall behind. I want the Switch to get up on par with the big boys because I have noticed this uh, pattern that I am uh, reaching more for my PlayStation than my Switch. Now the Switch is handheld. That is another discussion entirely. No one can take that away from me. I enjoy playing my handheld, you know. But I'm now talking about the Switch docked on the TV. It can't compete with PlayStation and Xbox currently on the big screen. That was my five cents on this. <laughs> that was my opinion on Sniper Elite 4. I'm just saying I'm enjoying Sniper Elite 4 is exactly what I was expecting. There's so many good and fun tro trophies in the in Sniper Elite 4 and I am enjoying all the objectives and the customization and the maps and it's such a such a game. So sniping games, they're just basically for me sometimes. I just enjoy it. Also playing Sniper Elite 5, but I sort of want to play Sniper Elite 4 all the way through and do all the things and then go over to Sniper Elite 5. It's just something satisfying. Let me know if you find sniping things satisfying. I do. Boy, I do. And I'm not even missing the gyro controls at this time. So that is a good thing. Check out Sniper Elite 4. Now over to some fun things. I see this is lying on the table, Death and Request 2, but that is because I'm borrowing this to neighbor Stefan because he's trying to do the Auni challenge, which is an impossible trophy to get on this. I am only missing that trophy to get Platinum, so he's gonna help me, whatever. Now over to the Elden Ring box. Now how cute is this? I got this from Bandai Namco in Stockholm. Now I have talked about Elden Ring on my channel. I have two videos. This one and this one where I talk about Elden Ring. Such a game. <laughs> that is really such a game. Oh my god. Wow. Elden Ring beanie. It's a hoopty guys. It's the perfect size. Elden Ring guys. Thank you. I feel so blessed. I feel so blessed. I mean how many people has this? I'm gonna live in this. I love hoodies. I will never stop using hoodies, ever. Oh, I need to wear it and show you guys in a b-roll. <laughs> so cute. Such a game. Such a beanie. Such a hoodie. Such a discount code on ishagaming.com. Isha10. Guys. I do all my purchases there now, if I'm gonna have something on either Xbox or Nintendo. And I highly recommend Elden Ring, guys. I really do. I've been so addicted. Now you can feel free to watch my other videos. <laughs> Maybe the ones that I have referred to in this video. Thank you so much for watching and listen to the podcast because it is funny. And let me know down below what you are playing currently and or has played lately. I wanna know. Let's have a discussion. Hit like on my video before you leave and I will see you later. Your mother's maybe.